When did I first start reading? Hard. Graduate school, while I was writing my dissertation on Plato, and uh, it was a welcome distraction oh, yeah. <laughs> from reading secondary literature, and those who dwell for their whole lives just reading Plato and Aristotle. It was nice to have someone to read alongside who knew those texts and knew those arguments, but had broader interests. And so, I think in some sense, reading her during that time helped me get through the dissertation process. Cool. And now, uh, what's your favorite book? I don't have a favorite book. I, I don't think of her as a writer of books, uh, but only in a, only in a like, sort of nominal sense. Um, so in that, I uh, just gave a talk on some, of, some portions of her Eichmann in Jerusalem, uh, so-called book, which I would consider more a series of articles. Um, and I, the reason I think that's important is that I think it shows a, a courageous aspect of thinking in process, thinking in response to events, rather than thinking systematically. Always writing a book in mind, or having in mind while writing that book other books you've written. Uh, instead, I think her cue is to think through something that's happening, and sometimes very often without any conclusion. Right. And uh, just generally, why do you think she matters in one way, or more than one? Um, I think she matters because, as well, she matters to me, and I think colleagues of mine, it, she should matter more too. So she's an example of uh, of a kind of intellectual that's not bogged down in, in, in the kind of professional argumentation that happens in journals. Uh, in writing texts of secondary commentaries, uh, that she took more of a courageous stance to respond to the, to the events of the 20th century and to speak up about things that were happening when other philosophers and intellectuals had nothing to say. Uh, and so I look at her as more of an example of the activity of thinking. And in that sense, it's, it's her formal uh, aspect more than what she says that matters, although that, of course, is, is relevant.